Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Caitlin. For those of you that are new here, and if you're not, welcome back. Thank you so much for being here today. On this fine Tuesday, I'm sharing with you my top five Tuesday. And in top five Tuesday, I'm going to share with you my top five favorites at this current moment. When I first started watching YouTube a couple years ago, favorites videos were some of my favorite things to watch, not to be repetitive, but I like what I like. I figured that I would share a video on that same wavelength with you. If you're interested in what some of my favorite items, products, things are at this time, then just keep watching. Okay, so the first two products are from the brand Burst. The first one, Press Restart Gentle retinol serum. Now I personally have tried retinol serums in the past, but I have always found that they dry out my skin and they'll leave me with pretty severe dry patches and just like flaky, icky, which is strange because I actually have oily skin. So when I have dryness, it's like very hard for me to combat. But with this one, the percentage of the retinol, it's very low, it's very gentle. As it says in the name, it's a gentle retinol serum. I do use this once a day at night, just before I'm going to bed and I have found that it has made a dramatic, dramatic improvement in the texture of my skin. I had just like little bumps that I was trying to work with and get rid of, and I found that a skin brush really wasn't doing it, double cleansing wasn't doing it, switching to an oil cleanser wasn't doing it, but since I've introduced this into my routine, I would say about two weeks ago, I have noticed a wonderful improvement in the texture of my skin. And it's just given me greater confidence to leave the house without putting makeup on, which that has been my dream for as long as I can remember because I've dealt with acne for a good portion of my life. Finding something that's helped with the texture of my skin, this product has quickly become a holy grail for me. Now sticking with that company Versed, the next one, this is called Keep It Supple Body Oil. Now with this body oil, I love it because the fragrance is so light. It is kind of floral. I believe it's Calendula and Ylang Ylang. So when you first put it on, there is a floral scent absolutely, but it doesn't linger. It doesn't does not last, which I really appreciate because I prefer things to be unfragranced. That's just a personal preference, but this is so fabulous for moisturizing the skin without leaving you feeling sticky or oily. It soaks into the skin. I put it on right when I get out of the shower and I call it a day. There's a spray application, makes it really easy to apply, and then you get dressed, you move on. For me, I like to put it on and then put my robe on though. That's like, that's really when I feel like I'm living. Keep it supple body oil and then the gentle retinol serum have been amazing since introducing those two things into my skincare routine. Okay, so next, this one's pretty random. It's a toothpaste from the brand Boca, Element Toothpaste. I actually heard of this from Organic Olivia and I use her herbal tinctures and she had sent out a newsletter. It was talking about holistic products that she uses regularly and she had mentioned this toothpaste. She was applauding it for its clean ingredients. So that immediately was a huge light bulb for me. I was drawn to it, ordered it immediately. This is, I would say, our fourth or fifth tube in the house. I just signed up for Amazon subscribe and save. That way they will just send it to us once a month. Very easy. I don't have to think about it. The flavor is mint, cardamom, and green tea, which I know might sound weird or kind of off-putting. Cardamom and green tea and toothpaste, but really it's just very minty. It's fresh. It's clean and there's healthy ingredients in it. So I very much appreciate that. If if you are in the market for a toothpaste, this has been fantastic. Moving right along, next we have for lip care. This is by the brand Laneige and it's a lip sleeping mask. Now here's the catch. Even though it's a lip sleeping mask, I do use it throughout the day. As we're coming into winter, colder months, it's drier outside, my lips are literally like cracky. When I don't have anything on, they get so dry. Sometimes they split and then they bleed. It's like very uncomfortable. It's not at all enjoyable. So instead of just using this in my nighttime routine before I go to bed, I use it throughout the day in lieu of a chapstick. It's a little bit thicker, a little more moisturizing than a normal chapstick, but it's not sticky. And I like it because it gives a nice sheen to your lips. So instead of using a lip gloss when, you know, like you have a scarf on or your hair's down and then your hair gets stuck in it or your scarf gets stuck in it, I just find this to be easy easier to manage and, and it just feels really lovely on the lips. The Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask, this is something that I have really been enjoying, not only in my nighttime routine, but throughout the day.
day for keeping my lips moisturized. Well, this is going incredibly fast for top five. We're already at the last product that I'll be sharing with you, which is the one of these five that I'm most excited about. It's this book called Untamed by Glennon Doyle. Now, if I'm being honest, I've been reading this for a couple of months, but that is very much by choice because I'm taking my time with it. It's so inspiring. It's so beautiful. It's so authentic and vulnerable and raw. I applaud the author. Glennon did such a fantastic job in showing up and maintaining integrity to her true nature and aligning with her true self and inspiring people like me, people like you to show up in this world and be your authentic true self. Something that was really beautiful in this book She's sharing um, a moment in exchange that she had with her daughter where she talks about disappointing other people instead of disappointing yourself. And that was just so, so beautiful to read. You know, and her daughter had responded, what about disappointing you, mom? And she's like, yes, absolutely. Most importantly, disappoint me if it means keeping you happy, especially if that means that you are maintaining integrity and you are keeping in line with your true self. And that's just one little blurb that really resonated with me. There are so so many, so many moments in this book that I'm like been laughing out loud. It has brought me to tears. It's just been such, such a beautiful book to read. I'm giving it um, as a couple of gifts for Christmas this year, just because there are some women in my life who I think would benefit and appreciate this book. My mom is reading it right now. When I'm done reading it, I want to pass it on to my grandmother. And initially when I started reading this, I had this thought where, wow, I wish all the women in my life would read this, but quite frankly, I would open it up and expand it. It's something that I think everyone can benefit benefit from because ultimately the point of the book is to encourage you to show up in the world and be you and create a life that you are in love with and don't settle for anything less. So it's very inspiring. It's a really empowering book if that's something that you're interested in. It's easy to read. The chapters are very short, very digestible. Highly recommend, 10 out of 10. And if you're an Audible fan, you can also do it on Audible. But this for me is just like, it's such a beautiful, like book cover. While I do enjoy Audible, I also like reading the physical book. That is it for today, my top five Tuesday. I do hope that you enjoyed this video. As I said, these are some of my favorite videos to watch just because I'm kind of nosy and I think it's cool to know what is making people's lives easier and more enjoyable. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. That way you never miss a new video. As always, be kind to yourself and be kind to others and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.